What's up everybody? You guys want to do a detox because you're trying to lose weight or you want to cleanse your system, whatever your reasons are. I know you want to do a detox because I get the question a lot, right? So a lot of you are spending lots of money on powders and pills. I get questions like, hey Paul, what do you think about this detox where you eat like seven cucumbers or what about just eating a grapefruit every other day with apple cider vinegar and whatever. You're spending a lot of time and energy researching these things. I'm going to give you a very simple detox that you can do and it's free. All you do is you don't eat anything. Eat no food for 24 hours, aka fast. Very simple thing to do. A lot of people when I tell them this they get kind of freaked out. Oh, I don't know if I can make it. You can do this. It's actually very easy to do just for 24 hours. That's it. Don't eat anything for 24 hours. Just drink water. Very simple. It's very good for your body. Your body will naturally detoxify itself. It's, it's really healthy for your digestive system because your digestive system needs a break from time to time from processes, processing food. So I invite you to do this at least once a year do this detox. Now if you're one of those people out there that have an unhealthy relationship with food as it is, you're not eating because you're afraid you're going to gain weight, I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the people who have gone at least a year or more without giving their body a break from processing food, okay? If you're already not eating food or you're just eating a very small amount of food, this isn't for you. It's for people who eat regularly day after day, year after year, and have not given their system a break from eating food. That's who I'm talking to, okay? It's very good for your mind too, mentally, emotionally. When I talk to people who have done the fast, many times their feedback is they feel like they now have power over food versus their food having power over them. If you're a spiritual person, I bet that your religious leader in the past, or if they're still alive, I'm sure that they do fasting as well. So there's something to be said about fasting. Give it a go. I, I'm going over this information really quick. So if you have any questions, just make sure you reach out to me. I'll be happy to give you more info on it. That's it, guys. God bless you all. Peace.